Walang kaduda-duda. Nanama na ni Dodie Boy Peñalo sa junior. Ang bagsik na mga kamao ng kanyang ama na si Dodie Boy Peñalo sa senior. Pagkatapos na makulay na amateur karir, pinasok ang batang Peñalosa ang professional boxing noong 2010. At sa tindi talaga ng kamao, siyam ang sunod-sunod na tinalo ni Dodie Boy Jr. At hindi simpleng pagkatalo, lahat ay natapos sa knockout. Ganyang kalupit ang batang Peñalosa. At taong 2012, naging panahon na para dumayo si Peñalosa Jr. sa Amerika nang maipakilala at ma-showcase ang galing bilang boksingero. Nakasa si Peñalosa sa Mexican-American boxer na si Jesus Luli Raya at dito na nasubok ang galing ng batang Peñalosa. From Cebu City, the Philippines, Dirty Boy, Peñalosa Jr. Jesus Luli Raya. Sa round 1, ang bibigat na mga suntok na pinapakawala ni Dodi Boy Jr. Going with that left hand down the middle, trying to catch up with Rea. Penalosa a little squared up right now. He wants to throw some power with his left hand. To the south bar, of course, that is his power. And then right down the middle with it, and he's able to bounce the head back of Rea. Rea's got some problem with the power, I'll tell you that, right away of Penalosa. Penalosa, as you notice, very quick on his feet. You don't come out of the Philippines undefeated as an amateur and 9-0 as a professional. With a lot of really good, tough kids over there, as you well know. And also doing a nice job showing the very, very quick hands. This is the 130-pound division, super featherweight division. His dad actually fought uh, lighter at junior fly. Look at these shots here. All power shots by Penalosa. When Ray is trying to turn up the uh, power, he's just not successful because he doesn't have the same hand speed or the same power as uh, Dodie Boy. Penalosa decked out in the colors of the flag of the Philippines, white with red and blue. Because he can't get to the quick Penalosa. Penalosa slides to his left, he goes back to his right, now back down, or, or circles around to his left, there's that right hand again, the left hand power shot is the one that he wants to release. A uh, nice hook with that uh, right hand, and it is a hook for the southpaw fighter. So he's got the good right hook, he's got a great straight left power jab. Not jabbing as much as I'd like to see, but he wants to take this guy out with power early. Straight, straight left, right down the middle. Nice combination, look at Rea, he's trying to get all over him, but the big power punch of all the shots that Rea threw, nothing sort of landed. And he's really paying for being on the inside with Penalosa. I'll tell you this, if Rea doesn't start establishing a jab with the left hand and hold him off and keep him at the end of his gloves, this guy's going to beat the daylights out of him. Yeah, he gets the jab. That's the right way for him to fight him, just like that. Double the jab in the right and around the world, leading up to a big fight between Manny Pacquiao and Marquez Four. Nice uppercut by Dodie Boy. Dodie Boy in the red and blue with the white trim. In the way it's formed, the shape of the flag of uh, the Philippines. You see, Rea is aggressive enough, but he's just not, you know, he, he, he's going to the well and coming up dry. That time he got to the body, that one he didn't come up dry. He landed a couple of body shots. He's willing to take shots here, but nothing really heavy landed the Penalosa. With all the movement, Penalosa again goes with that left hand lead. He loves that. He'd be better served if he served it up with a couple of jabs first and then the left hand. But he likes to go with the left hand power shot first. Rea comes in throwing everything to the hips. He's not getting a piece of like the live area on the left side or around the right. That one's a bit on the low side. Jay Navy, the referee, hasn't said anything. Look at that. All these punches being thrown, most of them missing, are being caught in the shoulders. There's a short, crisp right hand, and it drops Rea. That kind of shot. I don't know if he can recover. His eyes are glazed. Stay here. Stay here. Stay here. I don't think Jay's even going to bother to count him out. It's all over. He waved it off. He knocked him out with a solid shot. Man, what a powerful shot that was. New 
of the way Jay looked at him that he wasn't getting up. That's very, very impressive. That's 10 and 0 with 10. And watch the knockout punch coming. Boom. Right hand is coming. Watch it, watch it, watch it. Digging body shot. Boom, right there. The right hook, and it snaps the head. That's when the brain crashes up against the right side of the skull. Boom, right there. You don't recover from that kind of shot. That was a flush punch. Remember I told you, this kid continues to work on the inside with this guy. He's going to get hurt because he's throwing a lot of stuff and nothing landing. That right hand from Penalosa was a powerful, powerful right And this fight's all over. That's a second round knockout victory for Dodie Boy Penal. Your winner, by way of knockout, still undefeated, Dodie Boy Peñalosa Jr. Pagkatapos kay Raya, siyam na sunod-sunod na panalo pa ang naitala ni Peñalosa Jr. na karamihan sa laban ay naganap sa Amerika. So yan lamang po ang gusto kong ishare sa inyo ngayong araw sa mga kaibigan at kababayan natin sa Pilipinas, mga boxing fans at mga tulad kong OFW sa mampaling sa mundo. Kumusta po kayong lahat dyan? Kung nagustuhan nyo po itong aking video, pakilike at kung po pwede rin po, mag-subscribe na rin po kayo. Maraming maraming salamat sa inyong panonood. Shout out kay Edgar Balili, Antony Disimbrano, Jalani Tan, Arman Romero ng Malay Balay Bukid Non, Elijah Aguilar, Vicencio Boys, Juba Main, Marlon Amis ng Italy, Minandro Domingo ng KSA, Arnel Pabri ng Agusan del Sur, Sasi Capuno, Michael Carion, Mr. Shai ng Bohol, Billy Jubildad ng Tagigat Pampanga, Wilson Akop ng Jerusalem, Bobby Ong Suwiko, Alvin Tolosa, Vladimir Bixrak, Alfonso Cortado ng USA, at kay Mr. Marlo Rojas ng Edmonton, Alberta, Caranda. Maraming maraming salamat po sa pagsuporta nyo sa aking channel.